what though? I'd like to talk about some of how this rebellion shows up in our daily lives. Like, I want the kind of courage. I want the kind of courage that Jasper Younger has. Yeah, the kind of courage I, that Harriet I mean, Tubman has. I mean, that's, we, talk, we talk about it as revolution movements. Yes. We saw it in uh, the, the Arab Spring, for instance, mm, in, mm -hmm. in Northern Africa. Mm -hmm. It was something that stopped boiling somehow, and then we get to the point like, no, this has to stop. Like even slavery, they may say, oh yeah, it's uh, Victor... Uh, Schulcher, whatever his name was, abolished slavery. I'm like, no, no, no. Slavery just got to the point, the place where it could not continue. It could not. Because the slaves, they said, no, that's it. They, the, the enslaved <laughs> were like, no, nope, we they can't say, do they, this they anymore. No, they just said, no. So the credits of uh, the liberations is not going to go to a person and and worse is not gonna be a white person They're gonna take credit for stopping slavery no the slaves they stood up they said no this thing the enslaved they enslaved yes yeah the enslaved yeah yeah the enslaved they just say no this thing that's it it's uh you know it's uh that that time has come to the end to an end so now we end it so that's uh what happened so the process of how people re rebel i mean for i would look at it also in um you know we are spiritual beings mm. you know we know that we've uh, lived centuries of uh, you know oppression is uh, is not even the word I need like a word that's been because we're not even humans so when you know humans that's not the oppression is not doesn't even we're not word. humans we were not humans <laughs> we know no during slavery the black oh, person no no, no no you're less than we, a human we were less than a human yeah, yeah, sure. like, that's the context that was like, the message that the was sold we were less, like, to well, everybody they were sold to everybody yeah. we were less than humans we were animals or yes. even less than if, animals. if you start to feel kind of so. sad about what's going on with your human that your parent bought yeah, absolutely they would use this so, message so that the yes. thing so and also <laughs> Uh, you know, fear that was uh, put into us for that generation. People, you know, our ancestors did not have, uh, you know, it was not time. I would say they did not, it was not time for them to actually stand up, mm -hmm. you know, and because, you know, I believe, I still believe in that spiritual process also that has to happen. And then when it, ha when it happens, it started with uh, when we look at, for instance, Ngangan Zombie, we look at Dandara, we're going to find out. A lot of uh, uh, these uh, 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 this, uh, the, uh, this ancestors, they came from a lineage of kings and queens mm. that we are talking about. The blood did not stop the, royalty. the, the royalties. It was like the blood came here and those are the blood that just, uh, you know, it's like Kendrick said, I got royalties, got loyalties inside my so, DNA. <laughs> so you, 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 you have that. So yeah, then yeah. the DNA is worth is carrying it. We have a hard horse when it comes, was that time comes. And then that's what it just happens. And nothing can stop that when it happens. And nobody stopped that. And nobody, so that happening now, when we want to stand up for something, or any right. kind of injustice that happens to us, we know that black folks, we are proven. That to be unstoppable in what we want to obtain what we want we always did and eventually we go you know there is a, a, a stages of a struggle a stages of battle when you win something mm -hmm. and you have to keep moving forward with another battle to win that other thing because wow. they were it's so like never many ending <laughs> it's, it's, it's how, how have you rebelled in your life uh, yeah, when, I, I, when have these spirits showed my, up for you? My, my rebellion, first of all, just having these conversations. <laughs> yes. Having these conversations yeah. is a rebellion movement for me. <laughs> yeah. uh, like, you know, when I say to folks, for instance, hey, you know, I became black when I'm, I left Africa. Right. So I was not black. I was right. just a human being. What I is never thought I meant to be black. What uh -huh. was that for? So it was not a thing to be black. And is it even a thing to be black? Sure. You know, I remember the conversation we have with Gerald. We said, oh, back in the day in this country, it was offensive. It was people, offensive to, to, be say black. to say black. So we have accepting us as black because we want to make a statement. So I'm black, so what? You know? I'm black and I'm proud, right? I'm like black James and proud. Brown. So it's not an insult. If you say, oh, you're a black person, I'm saying, yes, it's, 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 it's evidence. Or even African was an insult. So, so yeah, African I mean, was an insult. So that's that's even strange. So you know what I'm saying? Like that's oh you African so like even within the black community to say you little African ass, you black as African, you you hungry like Africans. It's like an insult to oh, be wow. African. And that was also instituted. <laughs> really? oh, well, yeah, I, I, so, you know, no black yeah, and then if you're in South Florida, <laughs> right? 
If you're in South Florida, because I was living there, right? Because nobody likes anybody in South Florida. It's the most racist, segregated place ever, you know, that I've lived. But to be Haitian was the worst. Oh, wow. So, you know, like, kids in school would be like, you ugly like you Haitian. Because Haitian was the closest to African, you know. And they had more Haitians than they did Africans. And even if you were African, you might even just pretend you're not. <laughs> You know? And it's really sad. I I pretended like I yeah. wasn't African. My brother started learning the Jamaican accent because wow. because that was much more acceptable than to be African. You wow. understand? So we've come a long way. What kind of what kind of forever? We've come a long way since so 1998. You see, like there are there, there are layers, uh, <laughs> so you know, many never, layers. Never, never ending layers of you know. You know everything really relating to just uh, you know the the skin of your color. You know in the end it being being this because mm -hmm. you know I'm pretty sure when we're gonna talk about you know that's another debate color reasons. You know if you oh. the lighter your skin your lighter the skin is, the more favors you get from society. Yeah, the privileges, so yeah. the privileges that come with it. So it doesn't mm -hmm. matter if you're Asian. It doesn't matter if doesn't you're matter. Jamaican. Proximity to whiteness. Proximity to whiteness. Like <laughs> so that's yeah. the thing comes. It comes on. Okay, it's actually still the stick in the skin of a color. How, yep. how dark or how light are you? Yep. So. Yep. Um, 